everybody. I have a nice thrift haul from Salvation Army. They had 50% off if you brought your receipt in from a couple weeks ago, which we had. So we picked up this beauty. Look, she's got a padded bra. She's very fancy. So she was two bucks. Nice hair. I think she's a Russ. Yeah, she's a Russ. 80s. It's kind of nice with the outfit. So that will go in the collection. We got this cool rat fake shirt. That's not signed or anything, but that's definitely rat fake. Gear oil and it's a I guess it was a dollar seventy or two bucks or something. Anvil. Anvil. I don't know. It's a neat shirt though. With a good looking rat fink on there. Oops. That was good. I got a nice towel. I needed another hand towel for the bathroom. 50 cents. My crow friend is out there. I got some tea lights for 50 cents. And these were a dollar. These ones. These are funny. These are. Where the heck are these from? These are. Maybe these are IKEA. I think they're IKEA. Yeah, this looks like Swedish to me. Yeah. No, oh, that's always nice. I got some anchor hawking glass storage containers with lids. It's kind of nice to have them with the lids. Some things you want in glass. And this is a nice small size. And so these were a dollar for two of them. I found a light angel. We have some of these. We got them off HSN. This was a dollar and a half. And you put them, you mount them in your closet or wherever, and it's got a battery, and they're motion activated, so that we, or light activated, so that when you open the door, the light comes on and it stays on for a couple minutes. And then you just mount them, and you can adjust them however you want. So that, you know, you can always use more of these. So this is neat. I got this sign for the shrimp shack. I thought this would be really cute up front. Oh, get out of here, lad angel. It's got a cute little float thing and this little fish. And that crow. And that was two bucks. This piggy bank. This is a dollar. This is that this brand that I can't pronounce. Waxbox. It's that German pot. They make the red Christmas tree mugs and other, you know, they mainly Christmas, but they do all sorts of other ones. But this is a piggy bank with a zipper printed on it. But he's kind of neat. So here's a dollar. And he's that same pottery. That crow would take a hike. I got one of these finish can't remember the name right now. One of the their uh, enamel plates. This was fifty cents. I have a bowl that matches this. It's blue. This stuff's kind of neat. It's got some utensil marks. I think I can get them off with one of those Clorox sponge things. And I got these two dolls for six dollars. Uh, I think this is that. Ugh, my dress is dirty. This is that. Uh, uh, Star Wars lady, um, uh, Debbie Reynolds daughter, and this, I have no idea, she's a movie, if anybody knows this, ooh, hers is dirty too, anybody knows who this gal is, let me know, it's, it says, Paramount Pictures, and it looks, 1977, I can't imagine who that would be. Mr. Retros thinks it's a witch from Wizard of Oz, but she's always green. And she wouldn't be smiling like that. So, if anybody knows, let me know. 
So that, that was kind of cool. Those two for $6. Then I got this set of gel polish. Now I have to order a curing lamp for $2. But it's got three, four polishes and the top coats and the base coats. So now I need to get one of those lamps and give that a, <clears throat> give that a try. I've heard it's really good. You can like do your color and put, you know, stuff over the top and come off and stuff. So we will try this. That's okay for two bucks. And they had their jewelry set up again. Six for five bucks. So I got a few things. This is Austrian crystal. Bracelet, multi color. Well, that was kind of nice. It says Austrian crystal. This is a. This is a nice. I have a mangle like this, with gold and white. That's Swarovski. This one's kind of nice. And this one, these look like good quality crystals. And so do these. This is a nice blue. And uh, this says, I had to untangle this thing. This thing says, ooh la la. It's like a French necklace. Get her straightened out here. So that's kind of cute. And then this looks like a gold chain. It's got something written on it, but I couldn't see it. I have to get my glass out and look at it. But it looks like one of these those gold chains from the 80s. Well, that's all I have for today. Hope you're gearing up for a fun weekend. Bye-bye for Mystery Woman.